Welcome back. In this video, I'm going to show you how you can create an account for Microsoft Dynamic 365 Business Central. First, open any browser and search for Microsoft Dynamic 365 Business Central and choose the appropriate link. When you click on the link, this will lead you to a Microsoft website where you can create a Business Central account. So on this page, you have to click on the Start Free button and then this will lead you to a sign up page where you have to provide your organization email ID and then mm, click on the sign up button. When you provide organization email ID, then you are uh, giving information that you are creating an account for your organization. So next step, provide your mobile number to prove you are not a robot. First choose your country and then write your mobile number in the text box. You can use any of these features, text me or call me. I am using text feature. So I just receive a text message on my mobile. I am entering that code over here, six digit code and click on sign up button. Then in next step, you must have to provide your details like your name and whatever the password you want to create. So just follow the uh, given instruction to create a password and then in the next step, you must have to provide a verification code, whatever you get on your organization email. So here I am just refreshing my email box and here I get a six digit code that uh, email from the Dynam Dynamic 365 Business Central and then I just paste it over here. And after that, you must have to choose your country. If your country is not listed over here, then you should choose a United States and then click OK and this is the final step this is this will take uh, a little bit time maybe a few seconds or one minute and then led you to the office 365 portal here you must have to create an admin for this particular domain id whatever the organization domain id you have then click on yes i want to be admin to verify yourself you are admin for this domain you have to log into your domain server from where you bought this particular domain and have to do some entry in the DNS. So log in in your domain name server provider and then choose your domain and click on DNS. After that, you will find this page and give an entry over here. You have to enter the same entry, whatever the Microsoft give you over there. So choose text first and then entry the value and in the host name, write at the rate like this at the rate and the value will be whatever the value the Microsoft shows you and then click on save choose one hour in TTL because one hour is equal to 3600 seconds and then click on save that's it for DNS entry now go back to become uh, the admin page and click on okay I have added the record so after that this will uh, give you a message so now you are the admin for developer.co.in click ok this will lead you to the microsoft office 365 portal so where you can add new users and assign them a product license for microsoft dynamic 365 so let's see uh, how many users are active currently i am logged in so just i have uh, access on it you can add as many uh, users here by clicking add new user basically this will give you 25 user licenses so this is the product license so now sign in with your credential and click on accept or you can go to directly on businesscentraldynamics.com to see what happens this will take a few minutes or few seconds to finishing up everything for you or configuring everything and then this will lead to the business central page this is the Microsoft Dynamic 365 Business Central. This is the roles interface. You can see uh, many different menus are available just as you uh, see the role center in Dynamic Snap previously. You can do many settings. You can change company or you can change a role. Different, everything is same here. So make sure when you are creating a new user, assign them a product license because product license is very important. So here the product license is Microsoft Dynamics Business Central for IWS. So that's it for this video. I hope you really enjoyed this video. And if you really want to learn Microsoft Dynamics 365 Business Central, don't forget to subscribe my channel. Thank you for watching.